Here we are, a secret location in Northumberland. Ready to uh, hmm, try and improve this pond. So after we bailed out the water from the pond, we discovered that it had... It's concrete! <laughs> Does it look thick? It's kind of like bitty, but it looks quite ah, thick. Ah, good. Bit, bitty is good. So they've installed a lifeboat launch and jetty. And uh, the original liner leaked, so they've put the concrete on top of that, which leaked. And then they've had to put carpet and another liner on, uh, which apparently also leaked. <laughs> And during all of that, a spirit level was never used to get the edge of the pond all the same, which is why I'm having to take a foot and a half off this side of the pond with a pickaxe to get it down to match the rest of the edge of the pond. Otherwise, you end up with masses of exposed liner. John, can I wear your thing? Are you wearing it? So we're just installing the fleecy underlay and then the liner on top of that stretched out around the pond and tidying up around it. The next step is trimming the excess pond liner away from around the edge, leaving a bit to overlap. So what we're on with now is creating the bog garden and just sorting out the, the edges on the pond. Uh, it's a wildlife pond. I'm not going to ring it with stonework because uh, there aren't many ponds in nature where that occurs naturally. So it's going to be an earth surround. Uh, this near end here, I've almost got the liner covered now in, uh, in soil, which was just excavated from the pond edge. And we're putting that into what's going to be the bog garden area. Working our way gradually around, digging a little bit of a trench around the edge of the pond, sinking the, the overlapping liner into that and backfilling with soil. Um, and then the next stage, once all this is done, is, um, is to start planting it up. And a lot of the soil will contain grass seeds and wildflower seeds anyway, so they'll come through naturally. And we'll just allow that to happen. And that'll create a nice soft natural edge to the pond. So here I'm just digging the soil out from under the liner and turfing it into the bog garden area, chopping it up a little bit. Um, I think I spent too long doing that. Carry on. So there's th this is the idea, you dig a trench out, overlap the liner down into it and then start backfilling around the pond and you create a nice soft natural earth edge around the pond. Coming up in part two, we've got gravel edging, a dipping platform and a right load of cobbles. <laughs>